Oh shit, look at that, Mary J. With that freaking scythe, dude. Look at this guy. Yeah, man, great news, boys. He actually got his scythe, 2,994 KC. There it is, for those of you guys that, you know, wanted to know. First drop with this big task, a cult necklace, nice. <laughs> I just got another cult necklace, dude. We're getting close, you know, 700 more kills and I'm, I'm 2x strong on this thing. We uh, just recently passed 5... Surprise! <laughs> Yo, that is sick, bro. That is absolutely sick. Bro, that is absolutely sick. Wait, you can warn? What? What are you... What? Are, what? I'm streaming this currently. My boy, you know, Karamja only uh, Iron Man sent us a host just now. And I was just explaining this grind. This thing comes out of nowhere, dude. Right as I was talking about it. Wow, that's actually ridiculous, bro. Well, hey, this pet was deserved as hell, so you know what? Hell yeah, I'm out of here, boys. Yeah, this is boring, and this is lit, yeah. Alright, let's go ensure- Denied. I just closed the door on myself. Wow. Let's ensure this bad boy. Hell yeah, that's insane, dude. About a week ago, I got- this thingy right here, Smokano, right? That was uh, number 18, and now we have the Smoke Boy here, number 19, dude. That's sick. It's it's nice to actually earn one of these pets rather than just getting lucky on them. So where's the fire? I don't have a fire. No smoke without fire. Please stop, human. <laughs> nice, nice. So you don't cause lung disease. We're safe if you don't inhale, huh? He's kind of not a bad guy. You don't need suit anywhere, everywhere? Would you defecate on the floor like a camel? Neither would I. So no, I did not leave suit everywhere. Such a classy pet, bro. This man waited at the last second to... Oh, so Kano Shard. Wow, I haven't seen that in a long time, actually. Yeah, I just hit 1600. Oh my lord. <laughs> Oh my god, 21, wait, no, if it's 1500, 2250 would be 3x, right? Oh my lord, okay, we hopefully don't get there. Oh, you just got yourself a freaking pet, dude. Congratulations, I don't gotta worry about, you know, not getting a pet, because I already got one. 33 KC, bruh, very nice, congratulations. Oh yeah, just hit 1700 KC, oh baby. Oh, baby, man. Alright, we got it this time. For real, for real. Alright. Oh my god! Oh my god! Dude! Dude! Bruh! Yo! Oh my god! What? What? Holy shit! I've never seen a stack this big other than, you know, the freaking. The pet, holy crap, the orange text, I've never seen that in, in here. Holy Oh my god, today's the day, dude. I'm done, I'm fucking done, holy shit. Alright, 120 shards, crystal tool seed, dram pickaxe, let's go. Hell yes, boys. We have ourselves the crystal pickaxe now. The best crystal, well, the best pickaxe in the entire game. And fully loaded with 10,000 charges. What? That's crazy, man. Alright, guys, let's check out the collection log of the Sokano grind. Where would that be? Oh, okay. Nice. They put it on the bosses section. So, here it is. The pet. We got one tool seat. We got two... So can of shards, we got, whoa, three onyxes, really? But yeah, man, overall, pretty damn nice. We actually filled the collection life with this, so that's kind of cool. Haha, <laughs> even though, you know, stuff like this happens. You might be wondering how much resources they end up getting from 1700 Sokanos. And unfortunately, a lot of the drops just ended up stacking with my previous drops from other places, so I can't really give you a really good idea other than one specific type of ore, and that is Runite ore. 
So when I started Solcano, I pretty much had none just because I turned them on to dodge previously and I pretty much ran out. But yeah, man, from about 1700 Solcanos, I amassed 4,500 rune bars and 4,500 rune ores. They're about equal amounts from her. So yeah, man, totaling 9,000 basically rune knight bars. And that's crazy because what would I do with these? Uh, well, I would turn them into rune darts most likely. I did at some point have like 30, 40,000 rune darts, um, but I've used them all in, in the past. So now I have, you could almost argue, unlimited supply of rune darts. Um, yeah, that's 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 actually massive, crazy amount. And I mean, all these other ores as well, like Adam and stuff, you know, I, I have so much. I can give you guys an idea what type of ores and, you know, bars I'm packing elsewhere, but yeah, it's, it's actually you know, disgusting. A lot of this obviously came from Sokano. Some of them of runes as well. She also draws a bunch of runes. But yeah, the only ones that are precise is the rune knight. Now, at my level of 99 mining dram pickaxe and, you know, close to the best gear, I was averaging close to about 3 mil an hour. So in 1700 Sokanos using the 3 mil average per hour 15 kills, I was probably getting around 350 mil GP from all those kills. And, uh, you know, minus a few mil maybe on like supplies like sprues and stamina. It's not, not much though, honestly. But yeah, man, 300 plus mil profit probably from 1700. It's crazy. This boss is honestly one of the best money makers in the game at the moment. Players often get hacked through their emails being compromised. You might be asking, how do hackers get access to your email? One of the most common tactics is through database leaks. Many players often create ours accounts using emails that is connected to various other online websites. If any of those websites has a database leak, hackers can then use that information to potentially gain access to the email and therefore gain access to your RuneScape account. Luckily, Dashlane exists to help you monitor things like database breaches associated with your emails. Dashlane offers many other security services. Dashlane can manage all your passwords so you don't have to keep track of each one separately. Dashlane also has a secure autofill feature that works for personal information and credit cards, a VPN to prevent unwanted eyes from tracking your online activities. Dashlane works across all devices including all Apple products, PCs, Android, Safari, and Chrome. To get Dashlane for free for life on your first device, laptop, or phone, head to dashlane.com slash ricecup and use my promo code ricecup to get 10% off everything. All right, guys, I'm about to do an hour of Sokano with the best setup possible for Sokano. So we got the Crystal Pickaxe, the biggest thing. We got the Varak Armor 4 for the extra Tephras. We got the uh, Max Cape or the Mining Cape for the extra Tephra. And uh, the Elven Signet, which is a nice bonus, helps me uh, reduce the charge use by a little bit. It's about time that I talk to you guys about the Sokano Hose French Chat. So this is a French Chat that I use occasionally to find teams for Sokano. So it usually operates in four mans. You know what I noticed though with the crystal pick? I can get the uh, Tephra a teeny bit faster. Because like, usually I can't get the Tephra if, if the exploding thing is about to hit me, but I can actually get it now. Oh, just hit a 34. That's the highest so far I've seen uh, with a crystal pick. Alright guys, this is an hour of doing Sokano. So here is the loot. Let me uh, show you in a second. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys the XP per hour as well. So first things first, XP per hour, I was getting about 14.5K mining an hour, about 3,000 smithing experience an hour, 1.4K room crafting experience an hour, dude. Oh my God. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you a full hour of loot with uh, best in slot gear or a decent approximation here. So 2.68 mil regular loot and about 300k in crystal shards. So that's about 3 million, which is, uh, yeah, exactly what I was kind of looking for. It fluctuates a lot depending on how lucky you get, obviously, with stuff like rune auras and onyx bolt tips. I'd say uh, I was pretty average, you know, when it comes to the big ticket drops. 
So yeah, it could change quite a bit, you know. It could probably go up to four mil if you get lucky on some of the drops. But yeah, the crystal pickaxe definitely uh, did do its job though. So there's one place besides okay, now I want to test out the crystal pickaxe at, and that is the mother load. All right, boys, I just did an hour of the mother load. So as you can see, XP per hour was 52k. I'll be honest, pretty sure I was like in the mid 45s back in the past with the dram pig so yeah it's actually quite crazy but this thing probably costed quite a lot of charges uh looked like a few hundred for an hour but yeah if you have a lot then i guess it's not a big deal but very interesting nonetheless so i just did over an hour of using the inferno axe which is the best axe i would use outside of the crystal axe with the lumberjack top so this is the farming gill redwood and uh, the XP per hour, I was getting around 57.5k. So if you were doing Redwoods in the Woodcutting Guild, it'd probably be a bit more than that. Maybe like 60k, you know, with the extra Woodcutting boosts and stuff. You guys aren't going to believe this, but the numbers don't lie. I've been here over an hour with a Crystal Axe, and I'm getting over 70,000 Woodcutting experience an hour at Redwoods. 71k pretty much. That's about 13,000 experience difference crazy that is actually crazy even more massive difference than like the crystal pickaxe i've noticed but honestly both of them it's noticeable you don't really even need to see the numbers to know that the speed is definitely better on the crystal side by quite a bit so i've been at the redwoods for a while and uh, i think i'm just gonna stay here for the rest of the grind while i'm back because uh, i do want to get the wooden pet so that is extra credit, you know, on my pet list. Now, I'm thinking about using the Inferno Axe because it makes the Redwoods even more AFK. Uh, as there is a chance that the wood that I get just gets burnt. And I have a lot of ammunition to charge this thing. Like, I have 58 Dragon Axes. I, I might as well, I mean, it's just sitting here otherwise, you know. I have all these Dragon Axes. Alright, so I figured out some statistics with the Inferno Axe. So, the Inferno Axe has a 1 in 3 chance to burn a log. And uh, what that means is, to reach a full inventory, it would take about 50% longer. So that means I'm AFKing about 50% longer. The Inferno Axe at full charge is 5,000 logs. 5,000 Redwood logs, fire making XP wise, 1.75 million fire making experience. One Dragon's Axe worth of charge is going to last me such a long time, so it's going to take me forever. I'll never actually be able to use all my Dragon Axes anyways. 193 Greater Demons. Holy crap. Otherwise, no. Ooh, Zami Spear. Let's go. Oh, wait, I need to pick this shit up. Hold on. Ooh, we picked it up, boys. We got it. What the fuck? Ah, <laughs> uh, I didn't know. I totally forgot one of these guys is a Lizard Demon Champion. Ah, uh, what a troll, man. Oh my lord. My second Lizard Champion scroll. What the hell, man? It's not even my first one. Wait, what? Lizard Demon Champion scroll? Wait, I've never gotten this before? Or am I dumb? Seriously? What's this one? M champion scroll. Oh, my f blown. Cool, cool, cool. Actually, this task was more fruitful than I thought. Oh shit! I just hit three thousand rex KC. God, I need to start paying more attention. Let's see. Hey, three out of uh, the five thousand to the pet ray. Oh boy. Oh boy, we are slowly earning that one too. Eight mil, nine mil. And the warrior's ring to boots. Damn, 9 mil tests. Holy crap, guys. I'm over 60 dragon axes now. That's a lot of uh, inferno axe charges. I got one more video of Mr. Ironbar I want to do to wrap up the Elf City arc. And before I go, I just want to mention, you know, the usual things. My French shop is always open if you need a place to hang out. Mr. Ironbar. And if you want to make sure you don't miss out on the next videos, make sure you are subscribed and the bell is rung. 
If weekly YouTube videos is enough, you can also check out my Twitch at twitch.tv slash ricecup. I stream six days a week around 5 p.m. Eastern, showing the progress of my characters. And we also have a good community over there as well. Anyways, I will see you guys soon, hopefully with another video within a week. Take care and bye-bye.